The Brask Hydroelectric Power Station also referred to as 50 Years of Great October is a concrete gravity dam on the Angara River and adjacent hydroelectric power station. It is the second level of the Angara River hydroelectric station cascade in Irkutsk Oblast, Russia. From its commissioning in 1966, the station was the world's single biggest power producer until Krasnyarsk Hydroelectric Power Station reached 5,000 MW in 1971. Annually the station produces 22.6 TWh. Currently, the Brask Power Station operates 18 hydro turbines, each with capacity of 250 MW, produced by the Leningrad Metal Works LMZ. Russian, Lums Russian, Leningradske Metaliseskij Zavod in the 1960s. <laughs> Design and specifications Dam Components Concrete wall 924 meters long and 124.5 meters high at its maximum. Stationary part 515 meters long. Water drop part 242 meters long. Dump part 167 meters. By wall house 516 meters long. Riverbank concrete walls all 506 meters long. Right bank ground wall 2,987 meters long, left 723 meters long. On the top of the dam are the track of the Taishatlina railway line and a vehicle road. There are no navigational channels, because the Angara has no through ship routes. Nevertheless, the construction project includes the possibility to build a ship elevator. Power plant The turbine hall contains 18 Francis hydroturbine units, 250 MW each, with 106 m of operating head. A 5,140 m long penstock forms the Brask Reservoir. With a 4,500 MW capacity, and 22.6 TWh of annual output, it is Russia's second largest single producer of hydroelectricity. Output is distributed into five 500 kV power lines and 2220 kV lines. The plant was designed by the Moscow-based Hydroproject Russian, Hydroproject Institute, and is operated by the joint stock company Irkutskenergo Russian, Irkutskenergo although all the buildings themselves belong to Russia's federal government. A reconstruction project includes increasing the output towards 5,000 MW. At present, Irkutskenergo together with JSC Silovii Mashini Russian, Silovi Mazini is modernizing the aging turbines. Economics The plant powers hundreds of factories. It became a part of the Brask Territorial Production Complex Russian, Bratske Territorial no Proizvodstvenij complex about 75% of the output is consumed by the Brask aluminium plant. History The plan to build the hydroelectric plant was approved in September 1954 and later that year the first workers and machines arrived at Brask. On December 21, 1954 preparation works were initiated by the Nizhnyangagastroy department Russian, Nizhnyangagastroy later renamed to Bratskastroy Russian, Bratskastroy Concurrently, the city of Brask was founded. On December 12, 1955 Brask was officially converted from a workers' settlement into a city by the decree of the Presidium of the Supreme Soviet of the RSFSR. Construction was declared as the Komsomol's high-tempo priority goal and was in the center of public attention. Eventually, a lot of the workers were awarded state prizes and the plant became a symbol of the industrial development of Siberia. From July 1955 to October 1957 the 220 kV power line to Irkutsk was constructed. 
On November 6, 1957 the Brask substation received the first current from the newly constructed plant and later that year this current was transmitted to Irkutsk for the first time via the newly created power line. In 1961 the second 500 kV power line was added. On July 18, 1961 the Brask Reservoir started filling level raised up to 100 meters so that it became the largest artificial lake of that time. First stationary 225 megawatts generator number 18 became operational on November 28, 1961 at 1015 local time. After 7 days on December 5 the second unit number 17 started to operate and on December 12, 1963 units number 16 and number 15 were included into the unified energy system of Siberia. On May 9, 1964, operators began to control the plant as the central control post was put into service. On September 30, 1964, the last cubic meter of concrete was poured into the dam wall. Construction of a railway track over the dam began on March 3, 1965 and it started to operate on June 16. A vehicular road opened on July 28. On December 14, 1966 the last unit, No. 1 was operational and on September 8, 1967, the State Commission accepted the inclusion of Brask into constant use. See also Irkutsk Energy, an operator of Brask plant List of conventional hydroelectric power stations List of power stations in Russia